I just want to highlight an incredible development feature within Photo Studio 2026 that might otherwise get overlooked. Do you work with a lot of people in your photos? Maybe you do wedding photos or commercial model photography? If you do something like that, you might want to create development masking presets that can be applied in batches to different individuals. Let's show you how this works. I'll open up an image in develop mode. It's important that it has a person in it that we can select. To do this, I'll navigate to AI masking. This is on the top of the tune or detail tabs. Select masking and use the subject selection. With the subject selected, I'll make a couple of edits. The edits don't really matter too much here. This is just to showcase the power of this feature. I'll adjust the tone curves by increasing the midtones, lowering the whites, and lowering the blacks. Further, I'll slightly increase the vibrance in my image and also add a bit of fill light. Once I have some adjustments that I like, I can click on the large cogwheel at the top of the develop tools. This is gonna allow me to save a preset that I can apply to other images. Previously, ACDC couldn't apply unique masks to presets, meaning that when you applied a preset that contained a subject mask, the effect would be a silhouette of the original image that the mask came from. However, now the silhouette will always match the person that you apply the preset to. This window is asking which elements to save, and all I need to do here is click Selective Adjustments. But you can also click Select All to get the same effect. I'll name and save this preset. To apply this preset with a unique mask, to each of our images, I'm going to select a group of images and then navigate to Batch, Batch Develop from the top menu. Select your new preset using the dropdown and then click Develop. As the developments are applied to these images, you'll see that the development icon appears next to the thumbnail on your image. This indicates that development changes have been made. To confirm this, I can navigate to one of these images and I can verify that the mask is the same as the subject in our image by clicking on it, opening it up in develop mode, and by hovering over the mask brush icon. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And if you'd like, click the bell icon. That'll notify you when we upload new videos.